Hello and welcome to my channel. So how to really grow your art channel? That's going to be our main topic for today and it's going to be another one of those art talk type of videos where I'm going to talk about some other things as well, some of the things that have been going on over the past several weeks. But I want to get straight to the main topic because that's probably what most of you are interested in because many of you may have a small YouTube channel of your own and you might want to hear about how you can uh, get more subscribers or views and things like that. So why do I feel competent or qualified to talk about this topic? Well, uh, my channel has been growing. It has been doing pretty well. There was a time when it was really, really small. Uh, around two years ago, I think, I only, only had about 100 subscribers. And about a year ago, I had about 1,500 there was a time when uh, I had about a hundred subscribers or so and I was getting only a couple of dozen views per day and I already had dozens of videos. So my channel has been growing slowly but it has grown so now I feel like I have some experience and I have some advice to share with you. No doubt you have probably already seen many videos on this topic where people try to uh, tell you how you can grow your channel and uh, a lot of these people will talk about uh, selecting the right keywords for your titles, uh, the YouTube algorithm, the polishing your thumbnails, the special effects and the editing of your videos and things like that and honestly none of it works. I'm going to tell you right away that none of it works. The YouTube algorithm is completely unpredictable. There's no reason or logic to it some of your videos will simply pick up and others won't. I have no idea why that is so, but that's just the way it is. There is only one thing, there is only one thing that will actually work, and that is you have to keep grinding. You have to keep making videos. If you draw or paint, you have to keep drawing or painting every single day, and you have to keep grinding. That's the only thing that works. I know that right now you're probably very disappointed because my advice sounds simplistic and you're probably thinking there must be some kind of a secret. There isn't. You're not going to go viral. You're not going to be famous. You just have to keep grinding. There's no way around it. You have to keep creating. You have to keep working. You have to keep grinding. That is the only piece of advice that I can give you and it is the only thing that will work. Now probably you have seen larger channels of some famous people who've gone viral and you're thinking maybe that'll happen to me, maybe I'll be discovered. You won't. You won't be discovered and you won't go viral. Most people who go viral uh, don't go viral organically. Most people who get famous either on YouTube or on mainstream media, they didn't get famous organically they were usually pushed or selected. That's not your problem. You don't need to worry about that. You just have to keep grinding. You have to keep grinding and you have to keep doing what you do. And you have to keep trying to do it as best as you can. That's the only piece of advice I can give you. Like I said, it may be a little bit disappointing, but that's the only thing that'll work. Some of the videos that you make, sometimes you may invest a lot of effort into a video you can make a great drawing or something and it just gets very few views. You'll just have to accept it. That's just the way it is. And sometimes some other videos that maybe didn't seem quite as good to you will pick up and they will get thousands of views. That's just the way YouTube is. You'll have to accept that and you'll have to keep grinding. So I, I, was, I think I was completely honest with you and uh, that's honestly the only thing that'll work. Now let me move on to some other topics. Uh, a few weeks ago I went to a hiking marathon with my best friend uh, to a nearby mountain and I have to tell you I haven't been there in a while and there's something special about being in nature. It's just, uh, it's, it's great for both your body and your mind. So took a few nice photos and videos. I have an interesting photo of 
an oak tree that's leaning all the way to one side. I want to show it to you. Here it is. It's a very interesting shape and I think it would make a great reference photo for a future project so I might actually do that one day. Um, also I've been doing some commissions, uh, some of my usual stuff and I also bought a house. So that's another major thing that happened. I bought a house and eventually I'm going to be moving from uh, the apartment into a house and I'm going to have a lot more space so maybe I'm going to set up a larger studio and maybe improve the quality of my videos but um, I'm just going to keep making my YouTube videos in the meantime. I plan to do a couple of colored pencil drawings because I haven't done those in a, in a while. Um, thank you for watching this video. I hope some of it was useful to you. If you haven't already, do subscribe and check out my other videos. I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye for now.